Hi friends, Mrs. Heisinger here again. Today we have an activity called Match the Contractions. It may have been a little while since you heard your teachers talk about contractions, but if you look at all the words on the page, um, it might trigger your memory to see what a contraction is. So let's just go through and look. We have is not, are not, do not, can not, I am, she is, he is, they are, I'm, he's, their, isn't, don't, aren't, can't, she's. So take a peek at those and think. Do you remember now what a contraction might be? If you said that it's putting two words together into a shorter word, you're right. Um, so if you look at this right side here, all of these words um, have two words that have been put together to make a new one. And you see there's these little things. I'm going to try and mark them without covering them up. These things called apostrophes right here. You see it on the word she's? So there's an apostrophe, an apostrophe. There's one there and there and there, there, there. The apostrophe holds the place um, for the letters that aren't there anymore. I'm going to erase those now because that kind of makes it a mess. All right. So now that we've gone through that and we remember what a contraction is, we are going to do some matching. So look at the first one right here. Is not. Take your eyes over to the right side over here and see which one does is not match. I always told my friends when we were practicing this, uh, look at that first word, because usually that first word stays the same, okay? Is not. Do you see isn't? Shoop, right down here. Is not turns into isn't. So there's an apostrophe there because the O is gone. Got rid of the O. Now let's look at this next one. Are not. The first word is are, so take a look on the right side again and see if you see the word are anywhere. That's right, it's towards the bottom. Are not turns into aren't. We are not going to school today. We aren't going to school today. They mean the same exact thing. It's just these two words, are not, were squished together to make a new word um, and get rid of some of the letters. Next word, do not. I do not like pizza. That's not true. <laughs> Do not. Take a peek down, see if you see a word that has do in it. That's right, right towards the middle. Do not turns into don't. I do not like pizza. I don't like pizza. It means the same thing. Next one, cannot. Cannot. I cannot wait for school to start again. Cannot. Scooch down here to can't. That's right. That first word stays the same. So for cannot, we got rid of two letters, the N and the O. Next one, I am. I am at your house. Turns into what? Yep, all the way at the top. I'm at your house. Next one, she is. She is my friend. What does that turn into? Look for that word, she. That's right, right down here. She's my friend. You just got rid of the I. Next one, he is. He is tall. He's tall, right up there. That's right, you got rid of the I again. Last one, they are. They are, turns into, let's see, did we do it right? They're. They are coming over. They are coming over. Great job, friends. So now when you're reading, see if you see any contractions, words that have those little apostrophes, and they were two words put together. Talk to you soon.